Welcome to day two of lesson two. So, first of all, I would like you to read the story, August Heat. So you'll find the story is written sort of like a journal entry and it starts by telling you the place and time. Feniston Road, Clapham, August 20th, 190-blank. Clapham is an area in southwest London. We know the story takes place on August 20th, sometime between 1901 and 1909, because it doesn't give us an actual date, but you know that time of year that it occurs. Okay, so go ahead, you can stop the video and go and read the story for me. So, once you've read the story, there's a few questions I would like you to think about and some notes um, as you review the story. And you might want to look back in the lesson one notes from yesterday or day one notes from yesterday to kind of go, okay, so this is what I'm looking for here. So here's some questions to think about. Does the author spend a lot of time describing or developing a character through his thoughts and actions and relationships with others? So if that's the case, the focus is probably the character. Could the main characters be changed without harming the effect, purpose, or meaning of the story? If not, then the focus is character. If it's yes, then character is not the focus. Could the story happen in a different setting? If it could, then setting is not the focus. If it couldn't happen in a different setting, and the setting is vital to the plot and the, the end result of the story, then the focus is setting. Does the action or what happens drive the story? If so, then plot is the focus. Does the story convey ideas or revelations about life, mankind, or human nature? Does it make the reader consider life, relationships, or other such topics? If that's the case, then theme is likely the focus of this short story. So remember, all four aspects are in every story to some extent because that's what makes up a story. You need plot, setting, and characters, and action. <clears throat> but usually there's one that's more prevalent than the others. So two are stronger than the others in the story here. So as you review the story, Go through these questions that I've just listed and think about the story that you just read, August Heat. And then once you have considered that, you can go to your assignment document and answer the questions for day two. See you tomorrow.